Welcome to Global Data Store, the place where creativity meets data. We are glad to have you on Introduction to Data Management course, which is our signature course. If you are looking to learn the key aspects of data management, you are on the right place. By using Fast Track Learning Method, designed by our experts, we hope you will enjoy an exceptional and time-effective learning experience. Ready to start? Let's go to Brief Course Overview. This course is about data management. So, let's define what is the data management. Data management refers to development and execution of architectures, policies, practices and procedures in order to manage the information lifecycle of an enterprise in an effective manner. The key data management subject areas are metadata management, data quality, data governance, master and reference data management, data integration, analytics, data privacy, and data architecture. Data management subject areas are also called capabilities. Each capability has three aspects. 1. People refers to organizational aspect, the roles and responsibilities required for the capability. 2. Process refers to activities that are associated with the capability. And 3. Technology refers to technologies and tools required to support capability business processes. Data management subject areas are closely related and have synergized influence to overall data management framework. Now, let's define the course objectives. In this course we are looking to 1. Understand data management capabilities from the people, process and technology perspective. And 2. Understand how each capability fits into overall data management framework. The agenda contains eight lessons, and each covers one particular data management capability. Lesson usually starts by defining and explaining the capability and its key concepts, for instance, critical data element and metadata management. After you get understanding of the capability and its key concepts, we put our focus on capability aspects, such as people, in terms or roles and responsibilities associated with the capability, then process, in terms of capability activities, and finally technology, to define functionalities for the tools required to support data management capability process. We will start with metadata management, and then continue with data quality, data governance, master and reference data management, data integration, analytics, data privacy and data architecture. In addition, it is important to understand that data management capabilities are mutually related one to another. Therefore, we put some logical order in which capabilities will be covered, so we can have nice story flow throughout the course. That's all for the course introduction. Before we start with the lessons, please note that each lesson will end with a short quiz to check your knowledge of the subject matter and to make course more interactive. So, let's warm up 